What's up YouTube, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna be looking at the Vice skin. Some people pronounce it Vice, some other people call it Six, but I'm just, for this video, I'm gonna call her Vi. Now, she does come with two selectable styles. She is part of the Drift Tracker set. She does come with the back thing, the Foxbow Quiver, which also comes with two selectable styles. And it also comes with the harvesting tool, the Crooked Claw, that I'm gonna be covering in a later video. Now, this crew pack also came with a wrap called the Drift Swift. And then we do get the Kintsune's Pursuit. So without further ado guys, let's get this review started. So, bye. Now we did get a, an amazing dialogue over on Twitter, which actually explained her that she was given this mask to Drift, that somehow he was misleading and they were tracking them. And this skin came about with that whole thing on Twitter, which in my opinion is pretty cool. She does have a similar fox on the as a hoodie, which is the whole reason why they call the fox fan. And she does come with two selectable styles, which I would have wished they would have had three, just so they could incorporate that purple style that Catalyst did have back in season X. But having two styles is still pretty cool. Now she does have this electrical charge that kind of reminds me of Dragon Ball Z with the whole electricity going across her body. That is amazing. Then for the back lane, we do get the fox bow quiver, which I do like quivers myself, but there's just too much. We did get Daryl, we did get green arrow, and now having one for this skin is just a little bit too much. It does have selectable styles. In my opinion, this is the better one of the three that are out right now, but still it's just too much. So what are my thoughts about the skin? Now I've been seeing this for like years that they should just focus on sets and bringing new skins to the sets like with the whole fish stick with the fish food set they should just add like different variety of fish i think that would be very cool and they're kind of doing this with this but not exactly i do like the color scheme of pink and black with the white they look amazing and overall the skin is gonna fit fortnite very well so wasn't fun rain for vi i'm gonna have to give vi a 10 out of 10. if this skin was in the item shop she does have a lot of things going for her she is a legendary outfit, so it would have cost 2,000 V-Bucks, but still, it would have been worth it because the skin itself does have two selectable styles, and even the back lane itself has similar styles to that. So without further ado guys, let's get this combo started. For our first combination with Vi, I am going to be using the default that is tough, and I'm going to be pairing her up with the Michonne's Katana. Now this Katana, in my opinion, is the best Katana you could use with the skin. The handle itself does have that white color scheme that goes really good with the skin itself. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Forsaken Strike. The Forsaken Strike is a very cool animation it does have whenever you are swinging the harvesting tool itself. It matches really good, especially with the pink lining that the character does produce. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the Metal Mark. Now the Metal Mark with the Ultra Ego Edistel does have this pinkish color scheme that goes very well with the outfit. Then for the Contra, we're going to be going with the Rift Lining. The Rift Lining Contra just fits perfectly with her, even though it is kind of from the same set, it still works perfect. And for the wrap, we're gonna be going with the Lotus Star. What I really love about the Lotus Star is just it invokes Vox very good with the whole lore of the skin, especially because she is from Lucky Landing or from Wii Wii Tao. So having this just made sense. So let's check out this combo. For our next combination with Vi with the default edit style, I am going to be pairing her up with the Sleek Strike with the default style as well. Now the reason behind this combination is because the backpack itself does have an all black with pink color scheme that fits perfectly with the outfit. It also has knives on the side of it that are pink that just goes really good with the whole thing. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Michonne's Katana again, but this time as a harvesting tool. Now the Michonne's Katana itself just looks very cool. It does match perfectly, especially with the handle. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the style. Now the style glider, the wings themselves in particular are pink and white, which complements the outfit. Then for the contra, we're going to be going with the Sip Ribbons. The Sip Ribbons itself is just like this contra that is left behind that is black and white that complements the outfit. And for the wrap, we're going to be going with the Grab Fusion. The Grab Fusion itself is an animated wrap, so don't let it fool you. Each time you do shoot, it does have this electricity conducting in the weapon wrap itself that matches perfectly. So let's check out this combo.
Now, for the honorable mention with B with the default that is out, you could pair it up with anything that does have white, black, and pink. It's gonna look really good with the skin. For our next combination with Vi with the Arctic Edit style, we are going to be pairing her up with the Glimmering Cloak. Now the Glimmering Cloak itself just matches really good because of the color scheme and theme. It also has the things that she does have on her head tucked in in between the cape itself that looks very cool. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Bee Witching Blades. I know I've mispronounced that, but the Bee Witching Blades themselves are very cool. They are frozen blades and it matches really good. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the Winter's Wings. The Winter's Wings itself, you did obtain for free, and the best part of it is the color scheme is almost identical to that of the outfit, and the wings themselves are frozen. Then for the contra, we're going to be going with the Flaky. The Flaky contra just fits very good with the whole thing. And for the wrap, we're going to be going with the Frosty Glow. The Frosty Glow itself does have this arctic cool like frozen feature to it that looks amazing and complements the outfit. So let's check out this combo. For my last combination with Vi with the Arctic Edda style, we are going to be pairing it up with the Snow Star. Now the Snow Star itself just fits really good with the whole ninja theme it does have, so it fits perfectly with the outfit. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Icicle. The Icicle harvesting tool is very simple, it's just an Icicle that is used as a harvesting tool, but it matches really good with the whole theme and color scheme. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the Falcon. I know the Falcon itself is like a darker blue color scheme, but it just matches perfectly with the whole theme of the outfit. Then for the Contra, we're going to be going with the Ice Crystals. The Ice Crystals themselves is just crystals being formed on both hands and feet as you descend to the battlefield, which just fits perfect. And for the wrap, we're going to be going with the Big Flake. The Big Flake wrap is just an animation of snowflakes falling from the top of the weapon wrap or vehicle that just complement the outfit. So let's check out this combo. Now for the honorable mention with V with the Arctic Edda style, you could pair it up with anything that does have a light blue or white color scheme. Also anything from the Frozen series is going to look perfect with this outfit. For our first combination with the Fox Bow Quiver with the default that is out, we are going to be pairing it up with the Love Ranger. Now I really do love this combination, it's just because it makes perfect sense. He is based off Cupid, so having like arrows that are half pink just made perfect sense. 
Then for the harvesting tool, we're gonna be going with the Rift Edge. The Rift Edge harvesting tool is just all pink, so it matches really good with the pink aesthetics that the skin does have. Then for the glider, we're gonna be going with the Rose Rider. The Rose Rider itself is mainly all pink. It does have the metallic pink on the handle themselves that just stands out and looks perfect. Then for the control, we're gonna be going with the hearts. The hearts control is from the same set of them, but I just have to include it because of the hearts designs it does have. And wrapping this whole combination together, we're gonna be going with the chick. The chick wrap does have a darker pink that does translate to black, which looks amazing. So let's check out this combo. For my next combination with the Fox Bow Quiver with the default edit style, I'm going to be pairing it up with Clutch with the pink edit style. Now this combination just fits really well just because of the color scheme. As you can tell it does have white which the skin does have. Then on the edge of the quiver itself and even the arrows has like this hot pink that she does have on the gloves and pants she is wearing. Then for the harvesting so we're going to be going with the bolt bar. The bolt bar itself does have a similar color palette to, the palette to that of the outfit and backing. Then for the glider we're going to be going with the side rider. The reason behind the side rider is because it does have an all pink aesthetic that stands out and fits perfectly. And for the control, we're gonna be going with the Hyper Flight. The Hyper Flight itself does have this very cool, like staticky features in the hands and feet, which complements the back thing very well. And wrapping this whole combination together, we're gonna be going with the bubble gum. The bubble gum wrap does have a pink and whitish pink that looks amazing. So let's check out this combo. Now for the honorable mention with a fox box quiver, you could pair it up with anything that does have pink. Anything with white is actually gonna look really good with the back thing itself as well. For the next combination, we are going to be looking at the Fox Bow Quiver with the Arctic Edit Style and we're going to be pairing it up with the Frozen Knockoffs. Now with this combination, you could actually use anything from the Frozen series, it's going to look really good but I chose Frozen Knockoffs just because it matched perfectly because of the white pants and then the blue color scheme she does have. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Glacial Rift Edge with the Single Handed Edit Style. Now this is self-explanatory, it just matches really good with the whole Frozen theme. Then for the glamour, we're going to be going with the Snowfall. Now the Snowfall you could obtain if you did get a Victory Royale during Season 7. What I really like about it is that it is frozen, it does have that ice edge on the edge of the whole glider itself, and then on top it does have the snow. Then for the Contra, we're going to be going with the Flaky. What I really like about the Flaky is that it takes the whole screen and background as you're descending to the battlefield. And for the Wrath, we're going to be going with the Frost Flare. The Frost Flare itself does have a white and light blue color scheme that just goes perfect with this combination. So let's check out this combo. For our last combination with the Fox Bow Quiver with the Arctic Edit Style, we are going to be pairing it up with the Lynx with the Stage 1 with the curse scheme being blue. 
Now I just love this combination because how it just feels. The light blue and white just matches perfectly. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the no claws with the infantry at a stealth. Now this combination just fits really well. We do know that Lynx does make her own suits and stuff, so she could have actually constructed this to have her harvesting tool. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the holographic glider. Now the holographic glider is just a hologram from a glider, but it fits very good with the theme. Then for the control, we're going to be going with the DNA. The DNA control just fits really good because of the simple design and color scheme. And for the wrap, we're gonna be going with the Enigma. The Enigma wrap just matches perfectly with both the backling harvesting tool and the skin since they all have pink and blue. So let's check out this combo. Now, for the honorable mention with the fox bow quiver, you could pair it up with anything that is from the Frozen series. Anything that does have white or light blue is gonna fit perfectly with this backlink as well. Those are the four combinations I did find for V and the four combinations I did find for the Fox Bow Quiver. Let me know in the comments below which one's your favorite. And if you're new to my channel, subscribe. I post videos of fake cosmetic skins every single day. And if you want to support the channel, my code is Enigma Kid, all caps, two Ds, all together. Each time you guys use the code in either the item shop or the Epic Game Store, I do get a small percentage of it and it really helps this channel grow. And if you guys have any combo suggestions, leave them in the comments below. And for all my social media and Discord, they'll be in the description. And with that being said, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.